Bum. Hey everybody, Last Outrider here with a news video, interestingly enough. This is talking about the alleged hacking and suspension of the video that makes the Star Day videos. I mean, channel that makes the Astarte videos. And <clears throat> I'm going to preface this with some facts before I talk about the situation. If you go and look over the years, this technique of people posting Twitters or videos saying, my channel has been hacked and I've been suspended, can you please help me? along with other supporters, every single time that has happened, it turns out that the suspension occurred for a good reason, the channel was doing something wrong, that there was no hacking, and that it was just a misinformation campaign. It doesn't just have to do with 40k videos. It's just a standard tactic. And then what happens is you look at all of the uh, characters that put up the help me videos for the person. And they all tend to be linked to the uh, illegal or wrong activity in some way. So... Keep an eye out on all of these channels that put up the help me, emergency help me videos. We're going to see how this is going to turn out in the future, but I'm betting something dodgy and seedy is going on here, and we're just going to find out what it is at a future date. So, now let's look at what happened. These 40k videos are illegal. And I am surprised that they were able to stay up this long, to be honest with you. First of all, they're not that good. So the first time everybody comes out and says, these are the most fantastic 40k videos I've ever seen in my life, and we just need to keep them in existence. Uh, are you watching other fan-made 40k videos out there to say that these little one-minute clips are the best thing you've ever seen you already know you're dealing with a credibility issue when these people make that claim so let's move on uh, past that <clears throat> these videos were made for profit okay the Patreon website collected a between a $5 to, I think, $15 a month, a month subscription from people to make more GW videos. This is a very simple calculus here. Do these people have the authority from GW to make Space Marine videos? The answer? No, they don't. So when you are making money off of somebody else's copyright material, Space Marines, without that company's permission, and you post those videos on YouTube, and you use Patreon to collect the money, and PayPal. They're not even talking about that. I bet you their PayPal account has been shut down too. And don't even try to tell me that was hacked and I didn't have access to it either. These were illegal videos. Look at Warp Gazer. Look at uh, Hellreach. Look at... Um Ooh, the other, the Imperial Guard video, the Guardsmen, all of these. None of these sites, and they're much better videos, have a Patreon site that says, pay me to make more videos. And if they did, I bet you'd suddenly find their account suspended too. So then, uh, I know, I, 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 
I noticed that these same people, uh, they, 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 I think they're Russian who made the videos. I'm not sure who the owner of this channel is, but I noticed on the channel that under the about section, uh, it's written in Russian or, or so I, I see money involved. I see Russians and I see copyright infringement, and I am not surprised that channels are suspended. More importantly, um, some of these people who put up these emergency alert videos are also the ones out there who were the biggest advocates of Eternal Crusade, making the same claims that Eternal Crusade is going to be the best game in 40k history. Get out there. Give them your money. Play it now. And when I put out videos saying, what? Eternal Crusade is not good. They're not going to keep any of these promises. The entire, this looks like just one large advertising scam to get you their money and then release a steaming pile of crap and... Here we are, five years later, the same people who are making these help emergency help videos also made a videos for Eternal Crusade, um, also involving money, also involving Russians, and uh, maybe it's a giant coincidence, but I, I don't, I don't think so. Uh, these were illegal videos, the channels were shut down, the people are sued, they're going to get the money back, they, they had no authority to, to, to sell 40k products illegally on YouTube, on Patreon, and on PayPal, and now to claim that it was hacked, and in actuality YouTube is evil for doing so, well, the, the cycle continues. I'm going to be the one guy out there saying with the videos telling the truth and everybody's going to come and attack me and say, no, they're not. They're, they're fantastic. You, why, why are you saying bad things about these wonderful saintly people with their fantastic videos that you should be supporting and sending money to because uh, they're so great? Anyways, that's my opinion. See you next time. Bye.